Hey everybody, so we have a stack of boxes here. It's a Monday. That must mean it's time for Mailbag Monday. And if I'm not mistaken, this is episode six. I'm Glenn. I'm Xander. And together we're Fun King 3D. All right, so as you can see, we got a little stack of boxes here today. Just just three, but it's... Uh, it still works. Still works for me. I like it. Yeah. And uh, as you will see, we have a box that says AIO Robotics on it. We have a box that says Matter Hackers on it. And then Wait, we have a box. It, it's from Matter Hackers? I didn't realize. You didn't know that that no, was from I Matter didn't, Hackers? I didn't realize. Are you sure? Yeah. How about if I turn it around and show you this logo back here? No. Does that not help? No, okay. that doesn't help. <laughs> <laughs> so now understand that Mailbag Monday is not necessarily Fan Mail Mondays. It is Mailbag Mondays, which means that anything that it comes to us in the mail is free game. So, so that even if it's like a total scam, we can show it off. Yeah! Or something that we ordered. But the good news is, is nothing of this is what we ordered. We didn't order any of this. So this is legitimately Yay. fan mail, and we're going to actually do that last because we're going to spend the most time on that one. So we're just going just to slide that over there. So, All right, so... These two boxes are special to us because Xander and I are doing our first exhibit at a Maker Fair uh, coming up later in February, uh, February 24th, Gainesville Yay. Maker Fair. And uh, I reached out to a couple different distributors to see if we could get any type of banners or flyers or posters or anything that we could take with us to display to bring awareness. Uh, to 3D printing, which is why we're going to exhibit. Fun King 3D is is not a, a business. We're not there to sell things. Um, all we want to do is bring awareness to 3D printing. And so what better way to do it than with the amazing, amazing vendors in our community. Um, and both of these guys have been very, very good to us. And, mm -hmm. and obviously they still are because they were both willing to send us stuff. So I want to... I want to crack these boxes open and share with you guys some of the things. And this is heavy. It this is it's got some pretty good. Oh. <laughs> it's got some pretty good weight to it. Now we don't we don't necessarily know what they sent to us. Um, we just know that they wanted to send us some stuff to have for the fair. And uh, well, that's some good looking Ooh, stuff yeah. in there. So Matter Hackers was kind enough to send us. Uh, well, it looks like a stack of the white, which I know that looks great on camera, doesn't it? The white Matter Hacker stickers. And then the black. Some black Matter Hacker stickers. I'm going to have some of these. <laughs> some, some, I'm assuming oh, oh, those are stickers that yeah. I can't see the. <laughs> if you look closely, it has the logo. Oh, it's the logo. Yeah. All right. So that's got the Matter Hackers logo and Matter Hackers. So lots of stickers to give out. That's yeah. awesome. This, that's perfect. That's some 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 grab and grow pa uh, grab and grow grab and go pamphlet uh, information that we can hand out. A whole bunch of oh my bad. Um, a whole uh, bunch of lanyards and some lanyards. That is fantastic. Two special special people. There might be something in the packaging. There might be. There's not. Oh. It just fills it up. We can't get rid of this box, though. This box is too cool. So we can actually put all this stuff back in there and take all this stuff to Maker Faire. So Matter Hackers, thank you guys so much for this. Um, it's really, really appreciated. Yeah. It's, it's um, I don't know, maybe it's crazy, but it really means a lot to me that we can give back to you guys because you guys have been not only generous, generous to us, you've been so generous to the whole entire community. Mm -hmm. Um, you, you truly are a household name in 3D printing, and um, we appreciate the, the opportunity to, uh, to represent you at Gainesville Maker Faire. So okay, no need we'll to be proud. rude, but you can just open the next box. Just open the next <laughs> yeah. box? All right, so this one from AIO Robotics. Um, AIO and Fun King 3D have had a pretty good relationship from very early on. 
They yeah, were so they were very they were very was... quick to sponsor yeah. our. We didn't even have that was our drive to 250. We didn't even have 250. Don't get don't get don't get antsy. Don't get antsy. So I will get antsy if they, I want um, to. I uh, oh, oh, oh wow. Oh, 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 oh. All right, so oh, oh. I wanted to I wanted to get AIOs. Hang on, hang on, don't give it away yet. Oh. I wanted to get AIOs uh, AIO Robotics's name out there more as far as their products go. Um, I use a lot of their filament. They do actually sell printers as well. Um, I was hoping that there was AIO Robotics banners available. Um, I don't know if you guys watched the show Silicon Valley, but AIO was actually represented in one of the episodes of Silicon Valley. They were at a, a convention and AIO had a booth at this convention. And I was really hoping that one of those banners were available so that we could have one of those banners in our booth that was on a national television show. That would have been cool. Unfortunately, there were no banners available. Darn it. Uh, Jen's over at AIO was nice enough to send me uh, all the high res images though so I can make my own flyers or whatever I need to do, which is exactly what I'm going to do. And wanted to send us something uh, that we could use for, for demoing at the, at the Maker Fair. So he sent Thank us this you. package of filament. Yeah. So we can demo that filament. Yeah. Is that gonna be fun? Yeah. What's gonna be more fun is um, he also sent an AIO yeah, Robotics it's also 3D here. printing pen. Now, I've never played with a 3D printing pen, so we are going to actually get that set up and allow people to try it out at the Maker Fair. Kind of a little bit of a hands-on, which is cool because um, we didn't really have anything that was hands-on. So this is going to be absolutely magnificent. And then, um, and then depending on how the so show goes with the pen, we're going to decide what to do with this afterwards. Is this, this afterwards. A filament to go into the pen? Well, it's their standard filament, but yes, it is for the pen. Oh, okay. They sent us the pen and the filament. Okay. So... Okay, next box. <laughs> Dude, thank you so much to AIO Robotics. And again, we really appreciate the fact that you guys are willing to let us um, represent you uh, to the public and, uh, yeah. and bring awareness of your products. So you guys have been very good to us, and I, I, I can't thank you guys enough. I love, I love the relationship that we have, and uh, I hope that we can do more for you guys in the future. Are you done? That was okay. the important stuff. Okay, yeah. You can't yeah. you can't skip the important stuff. All it's right, so this is legitimately stuff. fan mail, and this is from uh, Thomas Lamarine, and I hope I didn't just slaughter that name. Every um, time we get, like, legitimate fan mail, it always has so much tape on it. People love to tape up the boxes. They don't want anything to fall out. Plus, they put this blue tape all over their address. <laughs> yeah. So that, you know, like, it makes it hard to deliver. Yeah. If you guys, uh, if you guys out there would like to send us something, or if you'd like to get one of our stickers, our address is actually down in the description. If you'd like a sticker, if you'll send us a self-addressed stamped envelope, uh, we will uh, we will ship you back a sticker. It's a letter. Wow, that is a letter. All right. Oh, we'll All right, we're not even well. going to get to the box. We're just going to do this first. Hello, <laughs> Fun King 3D. That's awesome. That's awesome. It is. It is. <laughs> Love your videos. It's very cool. You. You it's involved. very cool you involve the kids and get them interested in doing things and being engaged in a hobby and not just sitting on a couch watching TV or playing video games. I don't know what you're talking Xander's about. On this camera, he's pretty much playing video games. What? I uh, wish more parents would be so awesome. Oh, it's, it's a ruse. It's, uh, Who? It's movie, Who? Ma <laughs> it's movie magic. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he slaps me upside the head every morning and night. <laughs> so, but no, that is actually why we started Fun King, so that Xander and I would have something to do So that you slap me upside the head? Oh, yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway, set, sent you a tweet this week of the make all the things black, but unfortunately something in the black kept jamming my nozzle. Oh. Aww. It says add sad face here. That's pretty funny. Really sad as the first layer with the black polyalchemy filament was too friggin' sweet. It did. I, I seen that that picture. That was uh, that was some some beautiful first layer. But after multiple attempts, I went with the purple black ground. Back back. Oh, background. Sorry, I never learned to read. I can tell. 
I should probably put my glasses on. That Do might, you want me to read it? That, that might actually help if I could if I could see. You're taking forever. Uh, where are we at? Background. Uh, let's put on the spectacles. Now if I mess up, I don't have an excuse. All filaments are Maker Geek's Raptor PLA while except the yellow. That had to be Hatchbox Fun King 3D yellow. You know, we give, we give uh, Hatchbox a lot of credit for making Fun King 3D yellow, but it's just their yellow. Mm -hmm. But it's the yellow that we use for everything. It's, it's everything yellow on that a a AM8 is uh, Hatchbox. It's an so. AM8, yeah? Yes, it is. Yes. I uploaded the plate to Thingiverse, but haven't made it public yet, so the surprise wouldn't be spoiled. Awesome. Also going to design a print-on stand for the plaque. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. But thought it might be cool if you print it yourselves. Shoot oh. me an email or tweet and I'll make everything public. I also included some rolling stick thingies I designed some time ago. All but the orange one have interchangeable end caps, so mix and match colors. They also have threaded studs inside so you can get nuts that will screw on to add weight, making them a little easier rolling. End caps red are Hatchbox TPU. Yellow is Maker Geek's Maker Flex TPEE, and the blue and purple are, believe it or not, M3D brand Tough Ink. This stuff is really the only good thing to come from that company. Huh, I'm actually not familiar with M3D, so uh, I'll take your word for it. <laughs> uh, body's blue is High Five Blue from Protopossum. Hmm, have we ever seen that High Five Blue? I don't know. High Five Blue, that's a weird name. Who'd name a filament High Five Blue? I wonder where they got that from. I don't know. Orange is Maker Geek's Raptor PLA. Red and yellows are Hatchbox PLA. The yellow ones have a little surprise imprinted in it. Winky smiley face. <laughs> the first one I tried to use my .6 nozzle, and it didn't work so well as the walls are kind of thin on these. The second came out much better, and you can really see the imprint. If you don't know what a rolling stick thingy is, watch my YouTube video. And I'll put a link to that YouTube video in the description. I just got to copy and paste it. No. <laughs> Uh -huh. Or look up. Kurin. Kurin. K U R U R I N. I'm not. I'm. I'm not going to be able to do that. <laughs> Which is what I modeled it after. There are a mess of cool tricks that can be done with them. Anyway, enjoy your videos. I always laugh at the little jokes at the end. Keep up the good work. Do we do jokes at the end? I, I do. Thought, I thought those were facts. I thought you were giving people like historical facts at the end of your videos. Yeah. What have you been doing? Thomas okay. Lamarine. Sweet. And then he's got some links to the Thingiverse and stuff. Um, I have a bunch of designs uploaded on both Thingiverse and my mini factory if you are interested. And I will put links to... Everything that's on here, I mean, pretty much. Yeah, I will put links to all of that down into the description. Thomas, thank you so much. We haven't even looked at it yet, but uh, but uh, I do appreciate. Ooh. So go ahead, take it out. What? I can't. I can't get it out. I can't get. Just it. take them out. What in the world? Well, we're gonna have to watch the video apparently because I've never. This is what I really look, wanted to look, see. Look, look, look. Oh, oh look, this is amazing. Look, the imprint. Dad, the imprint. Oh, yeah. It's got the Fun King in it. Oh, this check this too. out. we got to switch over to the detail camera for this. That's awesome. That is too cool. Oh, gee, okay, there's a cool. second one in here. I think. Yeah. Oh, that is so awesome. So I get one too. And, and then this. there's this. <laughs> too cool. So, and then there's this. That's the polyalchemy, I think. Yeah. Cool. Do these have like an inside or something? Oh no, they're drilled. They're Thomas, drilled. it looks like maybe a little bit of under extrusion or that your nozzle is too far from the bed. But that first layer is is absolutely magnificent. So these look like like shotgun shells. The, I, I, like, I, you can put weights in them. 
Yeah, like this. Look. Oh, I didn't know you can open these. Yeah, so you can put. That's probably really annoying on camera. All right, perfect. Well, we're going to research these and figure out what we can do with them. I, uh, I get some too. He said there's all kinds of tricks and stuff that we can do, so that's that's pretty cool. Yeah, that one, the weighted one is, is much better. Very cool. Thank you so much, Thomas. Thank you to everybody who's ever sent us anything. Thank you for, to anybody that's thinking about sending us something. So, and again, if you want to send us something, the address is down in the description. I if you send us something, that. reach out to us, let us know that you sent it so that we can watch out for it. I wanted to throw that. Well, I didn't throw it. I just set it down over here. I don't here. care. I wanted to throw it. Well, you can throw it in the recycle bin later. That's going to wrap up this episode of Mailbag Monday. Thank you again. Thank you again to Matter Hackers and to AIO for supporting us so that we can support you, however that really lays out. But again, we're very, very thankful that you let us represent you to the public. That means a lot to us. I have the force. You got a load of something. If you like what we're doing, hit that subscribe button and ring the bell. Give us a thumbs up. That's always appreciated. And until next time, as always, print on.